Hi everyone. Okay, so this is going to be a tutorial on how to wear blue. Um, I don't know. I see a lot of people out there that just they take a baby blue like this, and then they just go. And I think that's cute, and it's um, it's not. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm gonna teach you guys how to. Wear a blue. The phone's going off. And um, hopefully you will learn from that. So <clears throat> the way I usually wear blue is I do um sort of like a light blue, dark blue, white and black. Um, it just, it, blue is, I don't know, it can be a hard color to work with if you're doing it for an everyday look. Of course it's not, it's, you know, you're doing it, you know, it's uh, an editorial or, you know, whatever. Um, but I'm just going to show you one way, maybe I'll do two different eyeballs, I don't know. Pretty much my tutorials, I just go blue. Okay, so what I'm going to do first is I'm going to take Sephora's Sephora's uh, eye pencil. It's it's like a uh, it's like an eyeshadow. So I'm going to use this as my base just so the blue pops out a little more. I did a review on this in my last tutorial. So. Yeah, so generally speaking, I don't care if your eyes are blue. Um, if you take a light blue and just put it across your eyes, your eyes, it's not gonna look cute. I don't care if you want to look like Barbie. Unless you're doing it for Halloween, that's that's fine. But uh, generally speaking, blue is just not a nice color to just slap on your eye. I'm going to take a eyeshadow brush, it's slightly scented, and I'm going to take this baby blue, and I'm just going to put that on my eyelid. Then I'm going to take NYX's chrome eyeshadow. That color. Ah, uh, has some sparkle to it. <clears throat> so I'm just gonna take a small sort of blending brush. I'm just <clears throat> taking the color and push, moving it or blending it over and to the crease. And I'm going to wing it out a little bit. I don't know, just for something extra. For my highlight, I'm going to take this. It's sort of um, like a yellow. Sort of. Um, I'll take that same brush that we used before. And just put it on the, the brow bone and then drag it down into the dark blue that we just put there. Now I'm going to take NYX black eyeshadow. And that same little blending that we did before. And place it right near my lashes.
I'm going to just blend that out really well. So it looks way more intense on here than it does on my mirror. Um, I guess that's what you get for using your laptop as a camera. I'm going to take a, it's actually a lip brush. I don't know, I use it for eyeliner sometimes, so I'm just smudge it in there. And then I'm going to take that, um, that dark blue. Used. And I'm just going to smudge that with the base. And then again on the bottom. I'm going to blend the bottom out a little bit. It's a little too blue for me. Then I'm going to take the black. I'm just on the outsides like we did for the other thing. Smells like fun. Okay, so now I'm gonna go in with some mascara. I like mine chunky, so I'm gonna use a few different kinds of mascara. So generally speaking, if you're going to go with the blue, I would go with the darker blue um, for, you know, whatever your look is going to be. Um, I just don't like, you know, um, light blue by itself. It just reminds me too much of Barbie and, you know, those little baby kits that you used to get of makeup. When we were kids. Now you can, if you want to make this more intense look, you can go um, put some black eyeliner on, but I'm not going to do that because it looks pretty ferocious look on its own. So, yeah, it's um, it's fun. Still blue, but it's better than just light blue on, on the eyelid. Oh, I just got one. Alright, um, so I hope that helps a little bit. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'm not going to do another eye, um, but, you know, just with blue, don't just do light blue, add some depth to it, add some black, or, you know, a darker blue, um, yeah, so I'm going to make another tutorial after this, I don't know what it'll be it, but I'll figure something out, alright, bye guys.